Good morning everybody, Ed Ballou in Palis Hills, Illinois at the Green Hills Library. We just started out phase two of our project here. Last year we did a small feature on the other side of the library. It's a small permeable paver system with a decorative water feature on top of it. Because of the success of that project, we've been invited back in and now we're doing phase two which is much, much larger. Behind me you see this large reservoir. It's a 15,000 gallon reservoir. It's going to capture all the runoff from the permeable paver system, which is a half acre in size. So all the water that falls on this parking lot is going to get funneled down into this underground reservoir, which is right behind me. From here, the water is going to get pumped all the way up by the front door. That's where the decorative water feature is going to be located. We have our main water feed going all the way up the side. We're going to tee off of that line. We're going to send the water to a booster pump. That water is going to be used for irrigation of all the planting beds and the islands inside of the parking area. Instead of sending all this water into the storm sewer and sending it a thousand miles away from here, we're going to capture the water, we're going to filter it, and we're going to reuse it right here on site. So we're turning a waste product into an amenity and an asset for the community. I'm standing right by the main entrance to the library in the location of the decorative water feature. So this is where that water is going to come from our storage basin and the water is going to come to the surface. The important part of this entire system is right here. The small decorative feature is going to tell the story of what's happening with all that infrastructure that we've done here. Right behind me you can see a portion of the pavers have been completed. We have a couple different layers. This is all specially designed for permeable pavers. We have CA7 which is a three quarter inch clean gravel. On top of that we have a layer of CA16. This is a 3 a inch chip. Then directly on top of that is our Unilock bricks. These have a specially designed opening inside of them. It's going to allow that water to funnel through those joints. Right behind me is the other portion of our permeable paver parking lot. It's going to get covered up just like the other side with the Unilock permeable pavers. Then in the far background we have our 15,000 gallon reservoir. We're back at the Green Hills Library in Palis Hills, Illinois, and our project is complete. As you can see right behind me, our water feature is operational, and it's 100% rainwater. And that far corner is our 15,000 gallon rain exchange, which captures all the rainwater right here on site. If you remember in the beginning of our project, this was a 26 foot wide, 36 foot long, and eight foot deep excavation. Once our phase of the project was completed, they came in directly behind us with this beautiful Unilock permeable paver driving system. In two weeks, the library is going to have their grand opening. Located adjacent to our system is going to be some signage. That signage is going to help people see what's happening underground, and it's going to help educate them on the importance of rainwater harvesting. Projects like this are going to become more common in the future as people become more aware of environmental issues and what they can do to help. This has been another Aquascape Project Showcase. We'll see you next time. So what we have going in here is a beautiful Unilock permeable paver system. Underneath that system... <laughs> We're gonna get kicked off of this job yet. <laughs>